I'm trying when I'm not actually talking to you guys to actually stop and shoot it so that it doesn't get like really shaky like this. Um, but yeah, I'm trying. I hope that I remember. shower I didn't do anything and it took me so long to actually get out of the door today and I realized this is why I try to get out to the library every day or at least every weekdays otherwise I would just stay put like a rock at home I'm really good at that I just stare at the ceiling so this is Pitt Street Mall um, so if you google it it's one of the landmark in Sydney If you come to Sydney, this is where you shop. So if you know your way around the city and also around the shopping malls, there is a lot of um, walkthrough which means that you can go in and then it comes up into a different street. So, it's probably better if you find them out because you know there are so many street lights so if you're walking it's pedestrian wise um, it's much more efficient so that you don't have to wait for the traffic light to change so yeah so i'm going into the shopping mall and gonna come out the other end i'm gonna get art supply that's why i'm out because i ran out of paper Ooh, what is that? Smile bear. I think you just sit here and then you, oh my god, you sit here and then you insert that thing into your mouth and then you just wait, right? I'm listening to this podcast right now about INTP, like in detail, and I'm like, okay, yes, I'm like, yes, because I'm an INTP woman, which is very rare, so I'm like nodding all the way from, um, like from the beginning of this podcast. Sometimes I feel like, is it better to be homeless? I know it's not, because it's cold, especially when we're going towards winter. But I actually have that thought, like, oh, and I think right now I'm actually there. Um, considering what I do sometimes, also live streaming, that it can be constituted as, I don't know, um, virtual begging, I guess. It's not the most pleasant way to explain it, I guess. This is such a good, like, right in front of me, such a good, I don't know, space. Right, it's a good space. It's like there's this space in between the buildings, this urban jungle, and then suddenly it's, you know, like sky. I'm just addicted to sky. Uh, wherever if I have to move, like ever, I need the sky. I need to see the fucking sky. It can't be covered up to, with pollution and shit. Like, it's not gonna work anywhere. The moon is waxing. It's the 1st of May. I'm freaking out. <laughs> because I feel like nothing is changing and I need things to change faster. Oh, I don't know. We're going here.
Ooh, he paints. If you are new to this channel, know that I'm an artist, I'm a watercolor artist. Please feel free to explore my shop, which is society6.com slash ballerine or gateway ring or ballerine.tkl.com or painting. I have to fit that in. Come on. sheet of paper and also got a masking tape so that the watercolor paper doesn't curl when it's being painted. That guy just threw rubbish out on the well, out on the road. Do you know what we call it we call that person in Australia? A tosser. A bloody tosser. We're gonna go to that building, the one that I just showed you, and we are gonna go down and to the supermarket, get something to eat, like for home, like, because I'm not gonna eat outside. Maybe we should eat outside. Ooh. Ooh. Now it's green. <laughs> this is what happens after you haven't talked to anyone in four days, or like in forever, in years. You get pretty good at talking to yourself. Okay, I'm distracted. I'm in the shopping now. Ooh, this is so nice. Look at this. Oh, it's very thin. Oh, this is so awesome. This is so good for 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 for. Okay, hold on. Let me give you like a full look so you know what I'm talking about. So I think this is like a full a full length. Oh my god, I'm a sucker for this. Okay, let's see what it's made of. It's made of. Doesn't say. What is it made of? Oh, here. It is made of uh, viscose polyester, 45% wool. That's alright. I prefer for it to be more wool. But I know I think it's pretty decent. Oh, this is. Uh, is it a different color? No, it's a different style. Look. This is so pretty. Most of my coats actually come from this brand. <laughs> so, you know, I started collecting it. So like when I was um, like 2005, because my friend was actually really, really uh, liking this brand and I got started as well. Oh, look at that. Oh, this trench coat. I love winter fashion. Oh, I'm so short for all of this though. If I wear them, it would be like, Drowning. I'll be drowning. Oh, this is so good. Look. Oh, look. Hold on. Let me get a mirror. See how I'm drowned in this particular thing? Oh, but I love this kind of thing. On the thing. Focus. We need to get food. We got distracted. Focus. Ooh, these boots. These boots, though. Focus. I love that. Don't look back. You're not going that way. Food. Let's get food. Let's get food. Food. Um, I wish there are more things that I can say to you, but that isn't really. This is my life. I paint, I eat, and I vlog. I live on the internet. I carry you everywhere. Oh, hold on. Let me show you. This. Isn't it such a good feeling? Hold on. 
let me let me like actually stand in the middle so that you can see. I'm basically just tipping this um, thing. Okay, hold on. I love the PVD. It's very English. This is what you call a heritage building and you're not actually allowed to knock it over so if you want to build a building in um, Australia and it uh, has like a heritage component to it you have to incorporate that into part of the architecture because you don't want to lose the historical value of a building you know to conserve our history basically Sometimes I think I just vlog so that I have actual proof that I leave the house. <laughs> I think this is what the vlog is for. Proof that I do exist outside my car. <sighs> Should we apply? Should we apply? Should we apply? I got my card, top up. So now I actually need to buy food with six bucks left. What can I get for six bucks that will last the whole entire week? Bread, let's get bread. Maybe we can just buy tuna. Tuna. Let's have out the tuna. This is very, 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 very lazy. I'm holding so much shit right now. I hope all of this will be like six bucks. It, it is, I think. So succeed 
succeeded, we managed to buy these things for $5.70. Yes. It should last, <laughs> what, two days? It should last like a whole week though. Just in case you're wondering, I didn't tell you. We are going to Kinokuniya, which is like a Japanese bookstore. Because we're gonna browse some manga. I haven't seen any manga in a while. I'm gonna do that. Because I need to be reaffirmed. I'm Asian. <laughs> An identity that is required to be Asian. like the cafe thing is happening here now they probably like they changed it a few times oh I'm still following this particular manga called wallflower I'm not sure if it's still on I've been following it for a few years now Igoyo. Oh, my flower. I really like this. Ooh. So um, the first, the first one is. Let me give you the the down. This is really, really cool. Um, so that's the synopsis of what it is. Um, I haven't really followed any other manga in a while, but yeah. So I'm gonna check this out. It's up on to 32. What 35? He is so cute. So yet incredibly hard hitting. This is the title for anyone looking for a realistic, unique, non Western centric insight into LGBT dialogue from the perspective of seasoned LGBT focused manga writer Takaku Shimura. Ah, this is how the world. They thought that I was just reading comic books. But no, I was reading manga. Manga is very different than comic books. Because I learned about transgender when I was in fourth grade. Um, because there is a manga character that was transgender, female to male. <laughs> this is what happens when you let um, kids read. It's like a superpower. The ability to read is like a superpower. Yaoi manga. Oh. It's so pretty. Why are the yaoi boys prettier than the straight boys? Not fair. Give me more like good looking straight boys. Oh, I remember this. Do you know what this is? Um, this 
this I think this guy I think this one is a girl and she she pretended to be like you know a guy and then goes into um, um goes into whole male school but as they're growing up they realize like the differences in the way the body changes um seriously i think this is why i'm so comfortable with lgbtq issues because i've been exposed uh, with a particular <laughs> concept and um topics ever since i was a kid oh my god what is that what is that <gasps> these are inks oh my god i want these these are inks inks they're inks i want inks let me zoom in they're inks they're 46 dollars 50 you know what this is is i think like you can't open it this way and then you can open the other way as well so this one is for i think this one is for when you want to draw a picture so this is for the right brain and the lines is for when you are trying to be more logical and more coherent and therefore you write down this i don't know where the camera is this is nice i like it how much is it uh it's 40 dollars around but this is nice Ooh, this color is lovely ah oh. This color. That's what I'm looking at. That's what I'm looking at. Ah, uh, this is actually. I've got a story about this. I kept looking at this way. So I have this story about that um, thing about the you know the color thing. Like there is this professor in I think psychology or sociology. I think I read this on Instagram or like Facebook, where they basically um, like showing you like a book covered and then it says this is red but the cover that the other the student can see is a black and then all the students go like no it's not it's not red it's black and then after about um about you know five minutes maybe going back and forth he basically just flipped the uh, book from his side from the way from his perspective and that actually showing like a red cover and this is like actually was a study about how um, how perspective is very different depends where you stand and it was more relevant about the black studies um, you know how like um, about racism so they were teaching he was trying to teach about racism about how you know until you stand in their shoes until you stand where they are you can't really say what they see and how they experience the world and i think like okay that makes sense i mean like point delivered i don't have any sarcastic remark on that i think that was just a clever example Moody. Kashmir, but I want to see the percentage because ooh, it's a hundred percent Kashmir, so that's nice. Always get a hundred percent Kashmir, guys. Oh, if you can't get a hundred percent Kashmir, get a like just very limited with with silk or cotton. I'm attracted to wood. Wood. I like to wrap them on my cheek, like paper. I do that too with paper. Oh, this is so pretty. Book. I want like a big mahogany dinner table one time to work, to eat, to do everything in. Oh, this is so pretty. like I'm from mainland China. This is so bad. <laughs> oh, I was rushing guys. I was rushing. It's a Japanese. 
um, company. The good quality, very simple. I think that's the whole point. Like the aesthetic is simple and um, high quality and minimalistic. The reason that it has a really good lighting is because from over there, there is a light. So that's why. Morning! Mandarin. Oh, it's really cheap, this Mandarin. It's like $2.50. Take your one. Like my favorite. Because what you can do with this, um, the peels, you can actually make it to a tea. And it helps your digestive system. So if you feel like you're bloated or anything, just boil some hot water and if you have some mandarin oil, eat it, but don't throw this away. You just put it in the hot water and then let it steep for a little bit and then you drink it. And it will help you soothe your stomach. So this thing is closing, so I have to get out. Ugh. I need to like stick around till like 6.30. So, because I don't want to pay double for the transport because I already paid double, already miscalculated my transport fee because it's like um, it's during peak hours, it's a different fee than if, when it's off peak so I'm waiting for it to be off peak right now also um, when I was like sitting down and just like uploading stuff to Instagram um, there was this lady who basically came to me and um, told me about Let's get out because if I go over there, just like town hall, it will be very crowded. Um, and he, she was basically saying, oh, you know, are you Christian? So like all these surveys, like, are you Christian? Have you read the Bible and stuff? So I think like the whole idea is to recruit people to go, well, she didn't reuse that word, but to recruit people to go into meetings and talk about Christianity and everything. So. Put on my oh my god I need to work out I'm hopping and popping right now um, I basically became the nastiest version of myself trying to be polite but I was like saying um, yeah it was really like it was really great that you approached me like you know Excellent. I know it took a lot of guts like reassuring her at the same time like to do all these things which you like you have to make people commit But I have to decline. I really appreciate you coming over here <laughs> This whole thing, you know when you actually have to decline someone but to assure it and do it like without being rude, I guess uh, And I was asking lots and lots of questions at the same time. It must be really hard for her though But I have but actually when I said all those things I really Actually, I really meant it, so maybe that was wise words. But yeah. I know I shouldn't be joking about it, but I guess I know where I would end up if I need a place to sleep and I'm being kicked out of home. Did she fall? I think she fell. Oh, 
went there once, like maybe how long ago? 12 years ago? 13 years ago? To the Sydney Norebang, which with this um, Korean tutor that was basically like an exchange um, tutor from Korea. And basically, all the cliche of the pole, the Koreans are actually full out and display, you know, drinking, party, and everything, gave me a headache. I just realized what we can do is actually walk to Martin Place and catch a train from there because soon it will be 6.30 and it will be off peak Oh, maybe I can... Oh, you can you use... Ooh, I think you can use the internet here Maybe just sit here and use the internet until it... Until it passes I think I'm not gonna walk all the way to Martin Place. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here and I don't know if this is gonna be a long vlog or not but anyway thanks for hanging out with me today guys and I am gonna go to supermarket buy some chips and then go home so I think I can just go back to where I came from just now and that should be okay